Hello again, my name is Gabe Zona. This is the 27th of January, 2019. They got him. Article posted on Fox News, written by Robert Gertie. Louisiana suspect in killing a five captured in Virginia after manhunt, police say. A 21-year-old man wanted for killing five people, including his girlfriend and parents, was captured after an intense manhunt that spanned several states. Authorities in Louisiana announced Sunday. Deputies arrested Dakota Three Oak when he pulled up to his grandmother's house near Richmond in Virginia Sunday morning. Richmond County Sheriff Stephen B. Smith told the Associated Press, The grandmother had asked deputies to check on the house to see if it was safe to return after spending the night in a hotel. She checked into the hotel fearful her grandson would show up. She was right. Smith said Thrill had a gun on him, but he dropped it and was taken into custody without incident. He will be transported back to Ascension Parish at a later date and booked on two counts of first-degree murder, home invasion and illegal use of weapons, Ascension Parish, Sheriff Bobby Weber said. Take a look at the photograph. That's his booking shot. Authorities said Thrill, 20-year-old girlfriend Summer Ernst, her brother, 10 or 17, and her 43-year-old father, Billy Ernst, were shot to death Saturday morning in Walker, located about 20 miles east of Baton Rouge. Deputies said they responded to the homicide just before 9 a.m. After the triple homicide, Thoreau drove to Gonzales, where he shot his parents in their home, authorities said. Now take a look at that picture. Who does he look quite a bit like? Huh? He could be the son of Jeff Bezos. You know, with that half face now working, the left side, the eye open much wider than the right side. He looks like Jeff Bezos. Keith Thero at 50 was found gravely wounded and told deputies his son was the shooter before he died. Quote, we are able to get a dying declaration from him and only enough information to let us know that it was his son that committed this act, Werber told reporters late Sunday. Elizabeth Thurot, also 50, was found dead in her bedroom. Thurot fled his parents' trailer in a Dodge Ram pickup truck that belonged to Billy Ernst, authorities said. This is probably, I would say, one of the worst domestic violence incidents I've seen in quite a while, Weber said. Authorities believe the shooting stemmed from some type of boyfriend-girlfriend dispute, WAFB-TV reported Sunday before Thurot's apprehension. I hope they did a blood draw and tried to see what kind of chemicals he's got running through his system, huh? Livingston Parish Sheriff Jason Ard told reporters late Sunday, there were no red flags warning of violence, he said. Thurot's only previous run-in with his office was a charge of possession of drug paraphernalia. Huh? Isn't that a red flag? What do you think, the guy just woke up and went nuts? Ard said Thurot began living with his girlfriend and her parents about two weeks ago. Crystal DeYoung, Billy Ernst's sister, told the Associated Press that she believes Theod had just started dating Summer. My family met him last weekend at a birthday party and didn't get good vibes from him, DeYoung said. She said she wasn't sure how her niece and Theod met, but that she believed the relationship was relatively new. Weber was quoted by the Baton Rouge Advocate Saturday saying that Theod's parents had recently kicked him out due to some disagreements. A neighbor reported that inside the Ernest residence at the time of the shooting were two small children, a one-year-old and a seven-year-old girl. They were not harmed. Neighbor Charlene Borden told WAFB that the older girl ran to her house and told her what had happened. She said she called 911 right away. A neighbor, Michael Logan, said he heard arguing and recent nighttime yelling matches coming from the theater at home, according to the paper. Again, it'd be interesting to see what kind of drug paraphernalia he was involved with, and if they did a blood draw to see what still might be in his system. Totally insane. I'll attach the link. Take a look at the embedded video. Take a look at the photograph and tell me if you think that there's a strong resemblance between Theroyd and Jeff Bezos, huh?